Deborah Scott, who is from New York, and she is a daughter of the king, and she believes in God's supernatural power on earth to transform lives. She came to bring the kingdom of heaven to earth and restore humanity to the heavenly father. The Holy Spirit is here on earth, she says, as the manifest presence of God to help restore people and churches and communities and nations. She writes literature and she's a songwriter and she enjoys teaching and mentoring and coaching. And she is called to be the bride of Christ as a prophetic voice of hope and healing and restoration. So with all that, let's bring on Deborah. How are you? I'm doing great. Good to see you, Elizabeth. Good to see you. So what scripture do you go to when you need encouragement? I believe it would be Jeremiah 33, 3. Call unto me, and I will answer thee, and show thee great and mighty things which thou knowest not. That's a really good scripture and a great reminder. Um, what is the first song that you'll be doing for us? This first one is called Incense Arise. I wrote it probably maybe about eight, ten years ago. Um, but the Lord has really put it on my heart for intercession, especially with the hurricanes and the wildfires. And I just feel um, in America, like people are preparing for an election. So I just feel like right now it's so important that we pray that we stay close to the Lord. And so I pulled this song out and it's time to sing it again. Prepare my heart before the Lord and uh, encourage others to do the same. Incense arise. Rise as we 
Uh, such a great first song. Um, what is it like for you to write music? For me, writing comes from spending time with the Lord. Um, oftentimes, I've been in prayer. I've possibly been in the, like a deep study. Like I might do a word search, or I'll be. I just want to know Him more, right? So, <clears throat> out of that place. Um, something will start percolating. Sometimes I will hear somebody else sing something. I'll hear another um, melody or some words that kind of like comes together inside of me. And mm -hmm. so then I'll, oftentimes I'll get my cell phone. If I get like today, I was out. <laughs> this is so just natural, but I was out with my husband. We were um, working with the horse and the donkey and I had a melody with some words and I said, I, I have to record this because if I don't record this moment, it'll be gone. And so he just chuckled. He's like, yep, another song. <laughs> so, yep, another song is on its way. And so that's where it comes from. That's awesome. What is your second song that you'll be sharing? Well, interestingly enough, the second song it does not have a title. I decided to share it with you guys tonight. It's really fresh hot off the press. Um, I have been somebody really interceding um, for the situation with the Hurricane Helene and then Milton. And I just been like trying to connect and, and encourage prayer. So <clears throat> this song came between uh, Helene and Milton. So it came between the two of them because um, I watched what the people did to help the people from the Hurricane Helene, so. The American hero of our time understands the call. Helping one another is the most important of all. Some are on their knees, praying to the Lord above. Some are boots on the ground, praying faithful and love. <clears throat> and not every stand, and not every heal, letting go of those things that keep us apart. Help me. 
Another great song by you again. And if you guys have any ideas in the comments on what you think you should title it, Yeah, I need a title I know. for that one. Um, such a another blessing to you know hear <laughs> God's word speak through song. yes, and you know, I I made a couple mistakes, but Well, we did it, you right? know, We did it. you know what? Red calls <laughs> that a remix. there we go. I did a remix tonight, guys. <laughs> So, if you hadn't said anything, I wouldn't have even noticed. Oh, thank you so much. And of course, Yeah. I didn't really notice it also. <laughs> oh, you know, and it's like, we got to get, sometimes we just got to move out of our own way. You know what I mean? <laughs> Yeah. so What, what is your third song that you'll be doing? this one is, um, it's called It's Time. It's kind of more rocky. You can, you'll tell, like, I have like a plethora, like, I'm not into one genre. <laughs> so this is a little different. Um, I'm doing this because our friend Liz loves this song, and um, yeah, it's kind of rocky. So here we go. It's called It's Time. Can you hear the sound of the lion roar? Can you hear the sound of the lion roar? The king is coming like we've never seen before. Yes, he's coming like we've never seen before. Can you hear the sound of the lion roar? Can you hear the sound of the lion roar? The king is coming like we've never seen before. Yes, he's coming like we've never seen before. It's time, it's time for the tribe of Judah to rise and shine with their hallelujahs, cause he's coming. the tribe of Judah to rise and shine with their hallelujahs cause he's coming like we've never seen before. He's coming for his bride, spotless and white. He's calling sons and daughters to stand and unite. The king is coming like we've never seen. Yes, he's coming like we've never seen before. Can you hear the sound of the lion roar? Can you hear the sound of the lion roar? The king is coming like we've never seen. What a great song again, man. This is going to be a powerful night, you guys. Um, what is it like for you when you're just spending time with God and you hear his voice? Oh, <laughs> uh, it is the sweetest thing to hear from the Lord. And um, I've been in dry seasons. And so there are times that we walk by faith. And there are times it says, when you seek me, you will find me. And so in those dry seasons, it's like you're in the word, you're telling yourself he is on his way, and you are waiting 
you know, and what do we do in the waiting? I, I remember seasons of life where I considered Moses, like he went out to the desert for 40 years, right? <laughs> so sometimes I have to remind myself, sometimes we are in a place where we are to wait, be faithful. We need to remain faithful, even in the silent times. And yeah. that can be challenging sometimes. It can be. And yeah. then we call up people. We call up people like Elizabeth. I need you to pray for me. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have another one or? Mm -hmm. No. Okay. But this is my gonna... last one. And this one I haven't um, shared much. <clears throat> and this is called Release Your Sound. And um, I just, I had put it to a track. I did it on a challenge and I haven't released it talk about releasing sounds. I haven't released this song yet, even though the track is ready to go. So then I had to transfer it to just play it off my guitar. So I think we, I think we can do this. Release your sound. It's time. It's time for the tribe of Judy. That's those worshipers to rise up and it's time to release your sounds. So here we go. Hopefully I get the rhythm right because <laughs> I just transferred it. such a time as this go into the world and release the good news let his kingdom come let his will be done in you it's time to the voice for revival breaking down. It's time to rise up and release your sound. You're the voice for revival breaking down. Your voice, your sound is needed now. Your voice your sound is needed now. It's time to rise up and release your sound. You're the voice for revival breaking out. It's time to rise up and release your sound. You're the voice for revival breaking out. A great song yet again tonight for you. Thank you for sharing your heart. Uh, where can people find you? I am on Facebook a lot. <laughs> yeah, so you, you can message me. And I um, am also like on YouTube. There's a couple things on YouTube as well as I'm on all the platforms. And I have two songs released and I have more songs I need to release like this one. So Awesome. That is great. Let's pray for you. Thank you. Dear Lord, I just thank you for this night, and I just pray that you bless Deborah and family, and I just pray that you continue to bless her and all that she does for different ministries, and Lord, I just pray that you continue to just bless her life. In your name I pray, amen. Amen. Thank you. Thank you.